Hi guys, lockdown has been officially postponed to May 3rd. It has been announced by our Honorable Prime Minister Narendra Modi at 10 o'clock today. And it's a decision which has been taken in light of prevention of spread of the novel coronavirus. And uh, since India has already crossed the mark of 10,000 reported cases, it's better we take precautionary measures for the betterment of the nation and its people. So let's start with the sports highlights of the day. Number one sports news of the day is Athletics Federation of India now seeks permission for the training of athletes during this period of lockdown. They are already working on this plan where athletes will be training going through a proper schedule, proper module during this period of lockdown. And they have further appealed to the Sports Authority of India and Home Ministry to allow these athletes to train under this lockdown. Currently, the training has been banned for these athletes in National Institute of Sports in Patiala and the centre in Bangalore. It is seemingly a transfer season for the football clubs. Earlier, they have been shipped from Goa to Mumbai, from Mohan Bagan to East Bengal and now, there is a news that Hyderabad Football Club's goalkeeper is all set to join Odisha Football Club. Kamaljit Singh of Hyderabad Football Club can join Odisha FC ahead of next season. The 23-year-old keeper had played 12 matches with Hyderabad FC, conceding 26 goals. He did not have a very successful season with Hyderabad and probably will try and look into a more brighter side of this whole transfer to Odisha FC. Good news for Kabaddi fans as Star Sports decides to rerun best of Kabaddi moments during this period of lockdown. With a full stop at all the live sports action all around the world, sports broadcasters are trying their level best to come up with new engagement programs on television and Star Sports has decided to telecast all Kabaddi events ranging from World Cup to Pro Kabaddi League on their television network. They have decided to telecast all the iconic moments of Kabaddi including the 2016 World Cup iconic battle against Iran in the finals and in Pro Kabaddi League last season's win of Bengal Warriors, the whole journey of the team and how they have come up with from nothing to winning the title. While all the athletes think that Olympic postponement is a blessing for them, they think that it is for a better and bigger cause. Manu Bhakar, a teenage shooting sensation for India, she has come up and she has said that Olympic postponement for them is on the negative side as it was their peak performance during this year and if the Olympic had continued going on for this year, it would have been better for them. Though she understands that health is the priority as of now, but she also feels that Olympic this year would have been much better for their team in general. At such a young age, Manu Bhakar has won a lot of laurels for the nation and is one of the medal hopes for India at Olympics. Like every sport, swimming has also found its way to continue the training and practice during this lockdown. Swimming Federation has decided to start online workshops for swimming coaches. The program titled as Swim Coaches Knowledge Series 1 will cover all the topics ranging from doping to nutrition to elite athlete management. This is it for the news bulletin today. Keep checking out our news bulletins as we publish new bulletins daily. Also, don't forget to like and share our videos.